It is time for the highs and lows of the week. And this holiday weekend, a bit of a twist. All highs for the holidays. No low, just a high. Our first high goes to having all your dreams come true on national TV on the 15th green. Local club pro Michael Block. Incredible story. He qualified to play at last weekend's PGA Championship at Oak Hill. He was the only club pro to make the cut. He played so well. You know who his partner in the final round ended up being? Rory McIlroy, golf superstar. And then for Block, it gets better. It was a hole-in-one so perfect that Block didn't even believe it initially. But you know who did believe it? These friends back in Mission Viejo, California. Huge watch party to cheer on their club pro, whose day job includes charging 150 bucks an hour for a lesson. Block finished the tournament in 15th place, winning more than $288,000. That is the equivalent of about 1,900 golf lessons he'd teach. With that finish, he jumped 3,000 spots in the world golf rankings and was invited to play at more PGA Tour events, including this week's Charles Schwab Challenge. Our next high goes to Joy, Grandma Joy, that is, who, along with her grandson, Brad, just pulled off something incredible, visiting every single national park, all 63 of them in the United States. The final one in American Samoa. The so two this is miles. the national park quarter for American Samoa. Oh my heaven. Yeah. There you go. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Jessica. You're welcome. This is just like Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> this is better than Christmas. It is better than Christmas, right? This whole journey began seven years ago when Grandma Joy mentioned she hadn't really traveled as much as she would have liked. So they started going from Grandma Joy's home in Ohio to, look at this, all of these parks all across the continental U.S. to Alaska to Hawaii, to the territories. Oh, I forgot my bikini. We're in the middle of a redwood forest. Brad documented these trips online. It inspired so many people with the beauty of these parks. And it turned now 93-year-old Grandma Joy into a viral star. It's the definition of trips of a lifetime, right? Our next high goes to everybody collecting their diplomas this graduation season and the people who love them pulling off some great grad surprises. Look at Vicki, graduating earlier this month from Eastern Illinois University. So there she is. She's posing for pictures after the ceremony when, surprise, her best friend showed up to congratulate her. But that wasn't all. <laughs> Vicky turned back around to see that. Her boyfriend, Mike, ready with the next surprise, an engagement ring. She's in total shock. She's apparently worried she's going to pass out from all the excitement. She did say yes, if you're wondering, as the banner makers thought she would. They had that ready to go. Congratulations to Vicky and to her fiancé. Our final high goes to the fearless wranglers of, no, not Yellowstone, but the great state of Michigan. Oh, yes. Check this out. A cow, see this, escaped its pen and was trying to avoid getting captured. There it goes, hitting the open road. Literally, I-75, right? That is no place for a cow. Eventually, look at that. Those Michigan cowboys chased it down. They lassoed the cow, brought it back home. Definitely not your typical Mustang chase on the highway. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.